destiny. Yo, sexy ladies want war with us. You know the car with us, them not war with us. You know the club, them want flex with us. To get next with us, them not vex with us. From the day my bond to ignite my flame. Girl, I call my name and it is my fame. It's a good girl, turn me on. Oh, what up? I gotta take the girl to yeah. Steve Wallace here. Steve Wallace TV. Ambassador of the show. That's a great name, too. Like Knock Doors. You never know what's gonna happen. Knock Doors. My wife makes me take out the train. Come on, let's get it on. Let's go, sweetie. Don't get agitated. Y'all go and rotate. Cause anything you want, you know you must get it. I live in Harlem. 7th Avenue, Harlem. Not 8th Avenue. East Street on 8th Avenue. I moved over to 7th. Hey, I went to the store. I'm Corey. Did you guys die? I'm Corey. Wave your camera. All right, we on BTV now. We on TV. One second. All right, Dad, what's going on, Dred? How you feeling, baby? How you feeling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You doing a documentary right now? Yeah, yeah, documenting everything. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know the drill, right? That's how you do it. Exactly. Taking out the trash. Hey! Hey, 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 it's like heat waves. It's like 90,012 million degrees. First in New York, it rained for like for like two months straight. Like every day it rained. And then it's burning up every day. I don't know. You can figure it out. Yeah. World about to blow up. That's what it is. Those y'all, those y'all not in New York, it's seven that Seventh Avenue right here. When things go down, I guess we should go to cops right there. I was looking for them straight up. I'm, I'm saying, y'all, it's like, you know, I know it's all funny games and all that, but you know, we're losing too many of our black men and black women. It's just still pity, man. Just 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 for lack of knowledge, man, you know what I'm saying? I mean, we need to straight up just wake up, wipe the crust out your eyes, man. It's, it's not a game. It's real life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Walking around the hood, I can't help but drop a tear for all I'm falling for. I think it's a little, somewhere a little more quiet. We can talk a little bit. I ain't seen you in a long time, son. I'm saying. Gotta talk. Catch up. But, you know, people talk about urban soul and what urban soul is. And you know, I, I just say it's about being in the heart of the city, you know what I'm saying? Like, what is the soul? The soul is the center of a person, the center of a being, you know. All the personalities, the traits, the essence of who a person is, you know. And what's the essence and the personality traits of an urban landscape? Being in the heart of the city, you know. So I think it's necessary no matter where you live, like especially for people that that rule and govern over these cities. They have to interact with the city because what happens inside the city has an effect on everything that happens outside the city, on the outskirts of the city, and every people's, everybody's lives, you know? But Urban Soul is just like, it started off as just an album, but then it grew into something greater. A friend of mine, Infinite, Inf Mega, peace out to him, check him out. Inf Mega on YouTube, uh, that's I-N-F-M-E-G-A. He heard some of the tunes from my upcoming album, Urban Soul, and he said, you know, it's such a visual story going on in the album that he felt like it needed to be, you know, that, that it needed to be shown as well in video. Let's keep walking. Let's keep walking. Let's walk down some more. And uh, so in the midst of that, um, I came back to him. You know, we, we were talking about Jay-Z, Streets is watching, and talking about how you know, it sort of portrayed the feeling of the scene when it would go to the different videos and stuff like that. But 
we decided to do something sim similar to that, but being that my background is a lot of musical theater, a lot of opera and stuff like that, um, I kind of shaped it into be sort of a, a mini movie musical uh, based on some of the songs from the album. And so it could really tell a story and paint a picture of what it means to be, what urban soul really means to me and my perspective living within that. And also, it also, it also steps up the, uh, the artistic value of the project on a whole. I mean, it makes it something, a new thing for people to aspire to, to be like, I'm gonna do a project, I'm gonna do an album. Just not like I'm gonna go in the studio for you know, 10 songs and be done with it. Not to say, you know, that's, that's cool too, but I've always been a person that's very conceptual, very story-driven, and you know, I just thought it would be a good thing for the fans.